Hey guys, guess what? We're back at Epcot Food and Wine Fest. What's our main purpose Part of coming two. here today? Well, we have two purposes of coming here two today. Two purposes. One, so one is... You guys don't know about this one. Both of them, I don't think they know. Okay. Last time we were here, we went to Ireland and got the Guinness Bailey shake and somebody threw away the nice cool cup that it came in. Our second reason is it's our second stop here and since we're pass holders, we have to come four times and then we'll get a really cute little cutting board um, for annual pass holders. Today's our second stop. We're gonna make a quick stop tomorrow and then we got one more time next week. Plus we're hungry, so we're gonna eat. We're gonna go to uh, Flavors from Fire, get something. So here's the things from Flavors from Fire. Last time we, we didn't get any food. All we got was the swine brine. But this time I think we're gonna do some piggy wings maybe. And yeah, maybe just those, maybe just the piggy wings. All right, there. We got our piggy wings. You gonna try these things out? Yeah. All right. Dig on in. Get some extra barbecue sauce, if that's barbecue sauce. Uh oh. Go. Is it good? Mhm. Mm Let's see. It's kind of a teriyaki. Teriyaki. Flavor. Kind of. Smells like it. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> We got our liquid nitro chocolate truffle. Just made it in there with liquid nitrogen. Yeah, it's pretty crazy. Much explosion. All right, let's eat it before it melts because it's hot out here. Yummy. Mm. Would I like it even though I don't like chocolate ice cream? Well, I don't know. To me, this tastes really good. Mm. Tastes like chocolate ice cream. Alright dudes, we are in Ireland, or at, at the Ireland booth, just got our, our shake, our Bailey shake, so I'm pretty happy, this is going to be really good, this is, what are you doing? This thing is delicious, and this time we're going to keep the cup, instead of throwing it away. Oh man, still good. All right, we're gonna try this somewhere else because it's really hot. Frozen caprina and I can't pronounce it, but um, it's their cheese bread. It's Brazilian cheese bread. Yep. It must cost a, a Brazilian dollars. Boom! All right, let's do this. Brazilian dollar cheese bread. Cheese is that anyway? That was a lot of cheese in the bottom, it seems like. Mm -hmm. Oh wow, is this heavy? Yeah, this is pretty heavy. It seems less bready and more cheesy. Oh my god. A little cheese. That's a big old glob of cheese, is what that is. There ain't no bread in that. I think the only the top is bread. It's a little too heavy for me. Yeah, I gotta say that the uh, cheese bread, we're not huge fans of the cheese bread. It's I more want cheese. cheese. Uh -huh. Only cheese was Guys, the cheese bread wasn't cheese bread, it was just cheese. They should just call it cheese. Cheese lump. Lump of cheese. 
relevant, then people won't get it. Yeah, because they'll know what it is. I would, because Now they're expecting cheese bread. Anyways, this guy Prana though. It's actually pretty good. It's made with Leblon, which we normally do not like as far as the Brazilian rum. But this is pretty good. This is... I don't know. Pretty good. Yes. Where to next? Alright, we are not stopping at Japan. But the cool drums are happening. Check it out. Yeah, it's got ice cream. And that's maple ice cream on top of it. With bacon. Is this a plastic? Is this a plastic? It <laughs> got right in my nose. It didn't go in there, did it? I don't think so. Okay, we'll find out we'll in a find second. Out. That is so good. Yes. So it's really strong. It's maple ice cream. Bacon? Bacon's bacon's pretty good on it. Maple bacon funnel cake. I mean it's good. It's okay. It's just real thick. JR, he don't mind. He don't mind. He's all in. Especially on a hot day like this. Like it's a little too heavy. You've been warned. Alright, we were gonna take a break inside of America because it's got sweet AC, but they were totally booked up. We're in Italy. Let's see what's in here. Coffee makers, espresso makers, cups, wine glasses, wine bottles, wine cups. I think we're gonna try the try to get a pizza pizza. Pizza we're pizza. See if it's only if it's reservations only or not. Let's get a pizza pizza. Hey dudes, we're in Italy and we made our way over to the Via Napoli pizza place. They have air conditioning and uh, pizza. It's a win-win. We're gonna get us a pizza and sit in the air conditioning, have some nice ice water and get recharged before heading out back to the sun. We got this garlic bread basket, whatever that is. Baked in house, she says it's really good. I'll be the judge of that. Pretty good. That is the Quattro Formaggi, which is a four cheese pizza. It is a white pizza. There's no red sauce on it, and it is. This is one four serving, cheese. guys. One serving. It's a personal size. This is a personal 10 inch. Plenty enough for three people. Mm -hmm. Maybe even four. Guys, look at these look at these trees. Do you remember these trees? Almost every time we come by here, we're looking at these trees. There's no leaves on them. They just look like fists, right? These ones and they just look like fists. But now they have leaves on them and they look like regular trees. What the heck? Well, how's about that? Just a normal old tree. be able to tell from the music. We've left Italy. Pizza was great. The air conditioning was better. But we gotta go because we got things to do tonight. So we're off. We are off. Let's go this way. Oh, 
All right, dudes, so uh, that's it for Epcot. The main reason we came today was actually just to get this thing right here because I threw it away last time. So now we, we have one. So we didn't have it, so now we got it. We got some pizza, that was pretty cool. Yeah, just a quick trip through Epcot. As far as we're concerned, guys, that's pretty cool. Thank <laughs> you.